Good morning, Bear. Good morning. <laughs> First and most important uh, coffee. is oh. this. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Maximus. Maximus, Maximus. Happy birthday to you. Let's eat cake. We love you, Max. <laughs> Happy 11th birthday. Yay, woo. Max is our oldest grandson. He's getting old. So you know what that makes his mom? And then you know what that makes his grandma? <laughs> That's funny. Even older. That's just really funny. <laughs> you know what that makes his grandpa? I'm old. I really can't get old, any older. Old, 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 old. Er. She's feeling better. I'm feeling better. <laughs> a lot better. As long as I don't move my head too quickly. I'm doing a lot better. <laughs> oh, he's ready to move. Well, welcome back. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Hope everyone had a great week. We had a, uh, a different kind of a week. One of the reasons we didn't do videos last week was I was out of town. She gets sick and I just leave her. <laughs> He's like, oh, time for me to get out of Dodge. Now he had a business trip that he had to go on. Yeah, I had to uh, <clears throat> fly to Boise, Idaho and uh, take care of some business for three days. So yeah. left left here on uh, Sunday, Sunday afternoon, I guess. The Sunday evening, Sunday really. Evening. It yeah. was like five, six o'clock Sunday evening. Left here, got to Boise, dark 30, and uh, yep. worked all day Monday into Monday night, worked all day Tuesday into Tuesday night, worked all morning Wednesday up till the time they had to Call me to the airport in Boise and say bye bye. Thanks for the visit. Got home around eight o <laughs> fifteen, eight twenty, something. Yeah, like that. my buddy yeah. Tommy picked me up here in the Palm Springs airport. Yeah, uh, took you too. Close to eight o'clock. So. Yeah, we appreciate that, Tommy. Thank you so much. Because um, yeah. I still was not good enough to drive the truck, and plus yeah. we had had all that flooding here. And so roads were closed all over the place, and They're Tommy still knows his way. Tommy knows his way around, and there's no way I could have. They still have roads barricaded off here in the Palm Springs area and the Coachella Valley due to all those floods a week ago Thursday, mm -hmm. and some of them they said would be six months before they reopened some of the roads. It's just crazy the amount of destruction that the water caused here. And but. it's not that they don't have a big <clears throat> giant wash plan for that, but some of the roads go like down into them. You know, they have alternate routes that are bridges that go over it, but... They cross the wash, you know, they dip down and they come back up, and it's just washed out. <laughs> washed out, even part of the golf course. I always question I, that. I never, we never understood why we, I can't even remember what road we drive on here. If it's 111, that's part of it. I don't think it is, now okay. that I said that out loud. But one of the roads, and it's a major thoroughfare, it's like a six lane, you know, three each way, <clears throat> goes over a wash. It's a low bridge wash and the water will go under the road but they built a humongous golf course down in the wash. And in the golf course some of the traps were part of that wash where they dug it out even deeper thinking ah, if it rains it'll just did it. Nah. It took care of that golf course. It's a mess. Uh, so while you were gone, yeah. I just kind of was a hermit. I hibernated. A hermit what? A hermit what? A hermit. A hermit what? A hermit's hermit. I don't know what. A hermit crab. Oh, no, I wasn't crappy. You weren't here. <laughs> the only thing I did was take Bear for walks to go outside. That was all she was allowed to do, Other and if, even if she couldn't do that, we had friends here where we are at Fantasy Island yeah. to take care of that for her. Yeah. I made sure. Yeah. No, I, if I need any help, there are plenty of people around, so, um, but I was, I was okay. I just chilled, watched Netflix. Tell watched, them what you watched. Watched stuff that 
Tom wouldn't like that. I wouldn't watch. Tell her. Tell him. Fuller House. Ugh. I always <laughs> loved Full House. And so I wanted to watch Fuller House. I and I did. And I couldn't I, stand the original. I sure as heck don't like the I want to be like the original TV show. Oh, very much like the original. It was very good. It was very good. It was You fun. only like the original because it had that fun. one pretty boy in it. John Stamos. Oh, God. Whatever. He's still looking good. What? Well, I mean, you've got... Yes, I do. That's why That's, she watches Fuller, Fuller House. house. <laughs> <laughs> if they had Full House on Netflix too, the whole entire thing, I'd be watching that too. Mm -hmm. Yep. I would. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you would. I like that show. And all of its corny punniness. <clears throat> it was very corny and very punny. But that's what... I just wanted something light and fun. Heck, we're running out of shows as it is on Netflix. We went last night looking through, and it's not like we watch a whole lot of TV. You know, we do it a couple hours in the evenings. But um, we, uh, we're running out of our sci-fi. We're re-watching Star Trek Enterprise. Started the entire Star Trek series over again. <laughs> yeah, after that we'll go to the original series, even though the original series was the very first one. But Star Trek Enterprise is was well, like a prequel, pre prequel almost. So yep. we started with that. We'll watch that, then we'll go to the Kirk one, then we'll go to the next uh, gen, <clears throat> next gen with uh, what's his name? Jean Luc Picard. 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 Jean Luc. <laughs> Boy, Capitan. <laughs> yep. I think we'll skip Deep Space Nine. We didn't really care for that series. We just finished Voyager, so it'll be another couple years before we get back to it again. <laughs> it's it's fun to watch them over and over again. Oh. It's fun to, when it very starts to see if we remember what episode it was or what it was about. Sometimes. Well, maybe not anymore because we've watched it so much. But there were a couple of times when we've rewatched them, it was like, I don't remember seeing this one. Yeah. So those are always good ones, too. Yeah. Um, Thursday? Thursday. Yeah, you were back. It was, it was your first day back full. And, well, first off, while I was in Boise, it snowed on me. Oh, yeah. Got um, oh, there's a lot of snow everywhere. It doesn't we... matter where you are, it seems like. All the way down into Mexico, it snowed the other day. It was windy and cold here on Thursday, and Las Vegas got seven inches of snow. Actual seven inches of snow in parts of Las Vegas, like up around Summerlin and that, and the northwest uh, area. It's just crazy. And... Uh, Lots of friends in, in the uh, Arizona area that got snow. Wilcox, Arizona area got snow. I mean, it's just, it's, it's just one of those winters. And it's, you know, is it strange? Yes. Is it the first time it's ever happened? Absolutely not. It has snowed all over the place. And it's just one of those years to where it's windy and cold no matter where you are. And, you know... With everybody talking about climate change and global warming, and then they make fun because it's so snow snowy, and they go, "Oh yeah, so much for global warming." That's part of global warming is the strange weather patterns and things like that. So who knows what it's really doing? You know, it's a big circle. Whatever happened then, it happened before, and it will happen again. All happened. We'll have to watch that show, too. Battlestar Galactica. Yeah, we need to get back to that. that one uh, we that need to one. watch the original with Lauren Green and then watch Battlestar Just, Galactica. If we can find <laughs> that one. I we'll find we it. We have the DVDs for the, the we'll remake of Battlestar Galactica. But we'll they were so it. totally different. I mean, yeah. those two series. Anybody else watch sci-fi a lot? We do. Um, we like it. But it snowed, I don't know. Two, maybe three inches while I was in Boise. Yeah, you got less snow in Boise than they got, than they got in, in Las Vegas. That's in crazy. Las Vegas. But, uh, you know. Um, no snow here, which amazes me. Yeah, because not here. San, San Jacinto Mountain is just right here. I mean, it's like you could reach out and touch it practically. 
and it snows up there. I can't touch it. Can't touch this. Anyway, it always surprised me that it doesn't even snow down here when it snows right there, so close. So Thursday it was windy and cold here, my first day back, and there was little spits of rain here and there, and we went and visited our friends Myron and Becky for one last time this yeah. season, because they're going that way, and we're going that way, and yeah. then they're going back home to Canada. Yeah, they're going, well they went southeast a little bit for a little while, they're heading more east, and then they'll go north, and we're going west, yeah. and then north. So. But, uh, but we won't see them again until December. It's going to be a million months before I see them back in <laughs> A million months. A million months. And uh, we went to Sam's Club yesterday because we got our, yeah, what do you call the certificate? It's a rebate. A cash rebate cash certificate rebate. for using your Sam's Club card during the year. Same thing with Costco, you know, how you get those rebates at the end of the year. And uh, she walked in because I had... Barry, I stayed with Bear in the truck. Card. I didn't take my card, and she walks in to get it, and they go, oh, you can't do it. You're not, not the, the primary. primary on the account. I'm like, come on, give me a break. Both cards are the same. They're the same number. It's just that the names are different. There, there must be some little code on it, though, that shows that I am not the primary. So they wouldn't give it to me, so I just went and grabbed a chicken and some milk, and <laughs> a rotisserie chicken and some milk, and we'll stop back by there today. <laughs> on our way to Street Bear, and he can go in. Yeah. Because we don't carry our cards with us all the yeah. time, so. Anyway, that's just yeah. crazy. It's not like the old days where the Mrs. had just as much right as the Mr. on everything. Now they have more. Ugh. <laughs> and, I remember my mom signing my dad's name, and never nobody ever blinked. You know, like on a paycheck or well, something. Yeah, no, no, that's the way it used to be. You know, it didn't matter who. You know. Yeah, right there in front of the te bank teller, it was like, okay, Mrs. Raymond Borges. You know. Yeah, that's the way it's done. Yeah, I mean, very rarely do you ever hear a woman call herself like, my name's Lori Giamanco instead of Mrs. Thomas Giamanco. The only indication was the missus that was meant it was me. Got it. Remember that? Got it. Your mom ever do that? She was Mrs. Charles Crowell. Got it. Yes. Yes. I remember those days. I can Amazing. remember. Amazing. I can remember back to that far. Yeah, short term memory. It's because you have so much nonsense collected up in your head that you don't need to keep that information. What'd you have for breakfast this morning? That same crap we always had. Oh, we didn't See? have breakfast. See? Oh, there you go. Good job. That was a trick question, <laughs> it wasn't was. it? It was. <laughs> <laughs> Friday, our buddy Bruce came and, and saw us. You know, yes. if, you, if you go way back to November, Bruce and Gary came up to visit us when we were staying in... Uh, Bakersfield, that was when we sang Cabaret. And Bruce came and saw us when we were camp hosting up in Oregon. He yeah. came by and We had a great, us. great fun, funny, and enjoyable visit with Bruce yesterday. Yeah. We took him to lunch over at Fantasy Island. Yep, yeah, but over there they have a... Uh, they have an old person's lunch. <laughs> it fit yeah. right in for Bruce. <laughs> and Lori. Yeah. It's only five ninety five. <laughs> There's a, a special menu you have to ask for, and it's five ninety five, and you have several choices, some good choices. There's a lot of food for five ninety five. I was Very shocked. Good. They bring you a bowl of soup, <laughs> and, or a little cup of soup, and then you have your, yeah. your lunch. So, like you had a, a hamburger, so it's like a big full hamburger. And yeah. Bruce had a um, tuna sandwich, but it's only like half a sandwich. Yeah. And I had a salad, and but it was a pretty good sized salad. Yeah, it was. So, um, so we had fun with him. And, yeah, nice nice visit. It's always uh, fun hearing Bruce's stories. Yeah. He is a huge Mizzou fan. So yeah. he travels and goes and watches all the college events. Like right now it's women's softball, right? Women's softball he here goes in the Palm and Springs area. Basketball, baseball, wherever he can go to watch any kind of Mizzou sporting event. Yeah. I mean, he's... He traveled where he was in Arizona not too long ago, yeah. Tempe. Yeah. And then 
at wherever he goes and travels. It's it, kind of his hobby. Yep. So it's kind of cool. They all know him. <laughs> <laughs> they all know Bruce. Everybody so, knows Bruce. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So this week was just kind of <clears throat> dull. Saw Jason one time for just a few minutes. Yeah. We never. He was busy working and stuff, and um, sadly, Candace's uh, grandpa passed away. So. Yeah. Um, don't know how much longer she'll be staying in Missouri, but uh, but anyway. And then today we are off to the street fair once again. Go see my buddy Tommy and his uh, radio station, 98.5 The Bull, is broadcasting live. Yeah, for the street fair. So he'll be 10 to noon. 10 to noon. We're going to go hang out with him a while and peruse through street fair. Tom gets more socks. Yeah, you know why? Because... <laughs> Because when we, we went before and picked up some socks, one of the, the short socks that you got didn't fit you, so yeah. I bought them. That's true. <laughs> they didn't fit. And it was funny because the, the lady there said something about, well, what's your shoe size? And she says, it's not the same on the socks. But all the other socks that we bought fit fine according had, to that. I had to argue with her. Yeah. And then... This pair of so these pairs of socks, the short ones, they the size on it didn't match the shoe. What do you look? Oh, I you forgot look my ball cap. I just realized what I'm wearing up here. <laughs> what you're wearing up there? <laughs> Holy moly! But anyway, he needs to get more socks. So and pick up our mail from Tommy. Tommy's our yeah. mail service while we're in this area. He's our mail service, our Uber. Yeah. <laughs> and a dear friend. And a dear friend. So oh we're basically down to almost our last, like, what, week and a half here? Yeah, probably by March 4th we'll be hitching up and pulling out of here and heading into Fontana, Fontana. area. We're going to go to Leisure Coach Works. Got an issue, and yeah. we're hopefully not going to charge us an arm and a leg to fix it. If they do, I'm going to say, don't worry about it. It's a luxury item. I don't need it. <laughs> yeah, it would just be nice for, that if it was fixed. Yeah. So. Well, there, and then on our way to Bakersfield. Yep, we'll be in Bakersfield for a month in uh, most of the month of March. And then we'll figure out where we're going after that before our camp hosting yeah, gig starts plan. in the middle of May in Truckee. April. If the snow melts. Oh, my gosh. They've got so much snow up around Lake Tahoe, upwards to 15 to 20 feet in some areas, below 8,000 feet. And above that, there's even more snow. Yeah, they've been getting slammed. Holy cow. Yeah. But the campground where we're going has about 17 feet of snow. I can't even imagine that. On I'm the just, ground. It's just crazy. crazy to see, you know, and that's not an area where it's getting, you know, plowed off or no. anything. So that's it's why just it keeps, keeps piling, piling up. up. So it'll be very, very interesting to see any kind of damage that's there, you know. I don't know. Yeah. And we're going to be there, you know, right as they're opening yeah. it all up. So, so we'll see. You know, who knows? We'll, we'll have to wait and see when we get there. Yep, we might be uh, <laughs> shoveling some snow. Who knows? Well, she will be. I'll be documenting it. <laughs> yep. Um, we're anxious to get to Bakersfield because yeah. Salem, our granddaughter, is going to be one year old. And we haven't seen her since November. <laughs> And you know, you know how crucial that time is when they're very, very young, how much they change. advance and change and stuff. So we're really excited. She's walking now and saying no. <laughs> no, that, that's funny, Ashley. <laughs> uh, I hope she puts you through the ringer. <laughs> oh, I, I do. <laughs> Just so you can laugh about it, right? Yep. Yeah. That's yeah. about it. That's about it. I do want you to think about this, though. If you have a can opener and it stops working, does that make it a can't opener? Just think about that. Oh, God. Talk about punny, huh? <laughs> Use our Amazon link if you're shopping please, online. We please appreciate please it. Start. Don't tell them what to do. Ask them nicely, please. If you're shopping online, please use our Amazon That's link. That's nicer. Or we're going to come looking for you if you don't. 
<laughs> Don't say that. They might want us to. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you're yes. a new subscriber, welcome to the family. You can subscribe for free here and you get all the free stuff that comes along with it. Yep, for all it's worth. <laughs> you get what you pay for, right? Click right. the little bell, get notified when we put up a new video. We're going to try to get back on track and uh, do the Throw Up Thursday video this next week. We may have one on Tuesday. We may have to wait another week, but we'll see how busy I can be. And if I really want to be creative. <laughs> yep. Okay, done. Done. See ya. See ya. <clears throat> Do you feel well enough now? You can get up off your butt and get me some breakfast. Oh, I don't think so. All of a sudden, oh. Yeah, I guess I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, wheel it is.